I received this question recently and I said, let me answer in a YouTube video. Is chocolate vegan? Now, I eat chocolate and I'm plant-based, so I would say, yes, chocolate is vegan. But there's so many chocolates that are made that are not vegan and it's really up to you to read the ingredients, be responsible about it, to find out if what you're eating is really what you're looking for right um the darker the chocolate is is the more likely it is to be vegan because they'll use it, the ingredients will mainly be just the cacao and some sugar possibly um but the lighter it is i think they add more milk and different ingredients to it uh, but again i would say read all your ingredients just to be safe and sure that what you are eating is exactly what you're looking for but yeah Chocolate can be vegan, you just have to read your ingredients. There are some brands that make like white chocolate that's vegan. Um, I, there's this brand that I get, I cannot remember the name, I get it in the health food store here. And they have, they have one with some quinoa thing in it that gives it a crunch. And yeah, I love me a crunch. So <laughs> it's likely that I'm gonna get the chocolate bar that has nuts and, and the quinoa in it. Uh, but yeah, you can definitely find vegan brands that make chocolate right now and um yeah there, there's a wide variety there's a wide variety that you can find so just read the ingredients some the vegan ones are labeled vegan there's some that's not labeled vegan because they're pro product processed in factories that make other things but that's up to you if you want to run that risk so something really cool too you can actually make chocolate on your own I did not know that initially, of course. Um, I wasn't curious about the production of chocolate, how it was made, what it is. So I, what I found out is that it's a plant and it's grown in tropical countries. So we have it here in Jamaica. It's called cacao. It's like, it's big, well, it's about this size, so a medium size um, fruit and you crack it open. I had it before. I had it for the first time uh, in maybe, 2018 2019 2019 i think the very first time like i live in jamaica and there's so many fruits that i've never had and that was one of them so i had it for the first time and it was really good you know i like sour so it was a mix between sour and sweet but the production of the chocolate from that fruit is what is really amazing to me i'm really amazed at the fact that the people before me and I mean, people constantly are inventing things and just coming up with new recipes, new ideas, learning new things from the earth. But how did they know that that fruit, once you dry it and you, you, you take off the, the white pulp part, the nut, I'd call it a nut, can make chocolate. So, I mean, but there's so many videos on YouTube that you can watch to see the production of it. I'll probably do a video making it myself one day. <sighs> Yeah, I'll do it one day. <laughs> the thought about it just kind of threw me off. But I'll do it one day and we can go into how chocolate is really made. Uh, and the different ingredients that you can add to it to make it taste how you want it to taste. Because dark chocolate is actually a bit bitter. You know, so a lot of persons prefer white chocolate or milk chocolate. So, um, but yeah, yeah, chocolate can be vegan. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned by turning on notifications for more content from me.